Hello everyone, BJ in the house with another review. That one right there. You Bicycle Persian Empire Royal Edition. Uh, from Kickstarter, just got it a couple days ago. And let's take a look at it. The top says Bicycle, of course. And it says a Persian Empire Royal Edition. You see, well there's a body of water there, a river of some sort I think. A boat on it, and it looks like some kind of a castle, maybe Egyptian or something. There are palaces, really, I should say, not a castle, and that's what it's all about. Uh, lots of nice details. Um, in front of the box, the sides you get your spade, diamond, club, and heart. Same with the other side. The top has some kind of a mythical creature, I guess it is, with person with wings. And then the bottom barcode and USB-C info. The back is uh, basically a map of Persia, which is pretty cool. That's not the back design. There is no seal, as you can see. And then the flap says www.persianempire.com. And there's bicycle trademark stuff. And then the flaps here just got the pattern from the side of the box, which is a diamond type pattern. And then we get to the cards. Inside we do get, instead of ad cards or gaff cards, we get two cards. You put them together and you get, whoops, like this, a map of Persia. I like that. I like maps. I think that's pretty cool, unique. They used to have a bandana as well. That was a map. But this for me is a little bit better. And then the back, so it's the back design, which... Almost has a diamond back type pattern. I guess it's kind of like a prison rug. It's pretty cool. It does have a dirty look on the borders instead of being just clean white borders. I don't know if you can see that or not. Then we get to the cards. Your Joker save a prison empire and you got that winged mythical creature or whatever. The index has a J and there's also a symbol and I think it also says there is a uh, prison language symbol as well and that one's brown in color it's a little bit hard just to make out what's going on there in my opinion and the other joker is the same except red the ace of spades says the Persian empire and it's got a nice little spade pip it's got a circular thing on it it's got a dirty, cracked look to it. And then they got this weird diamond border, which really doesn't make sense. It doesn't fit. I don't understand. Is that supposed to be like the palace floor or something? I, I don't get it. It just doesn't fit. It doesn't match the borders, whereas the face would have matched it more. But whatever. It's, it's different. All the aces are similar, as you can see. And unique. And voila. Put that away. Court cards. Uh, similar to the ones in the other deck. Prison figures. If I go too fast, you can always pause, rewind. There, this was a problem from before, and that was almost the same thing. Because people were criticizing him for. Claiming that his artwork was all 100% done by hand and unique, and then it was found that they were basically copy and paste, and he wouldn't admit it. But he did eventually get funded a second time around, but he did not receive, uh, and that was for the previous deck, but he did not receive enough funding for the stretch goal of this deck, so he had to go get it funded individually, and it, it did work, he got it funded. And number cards, interesting pip formations. You all got that circular thing in the center. Definitely different. And that's that. Uh, unlike the previous deck, these cards do have an Ericus and Finis and a bicycle stock. The previous one is not that good in my opinion. It was just a Kind of flimsy, smooth finish. 
I'm not sure if it was bicycle stock or not or if it was aristocrat, but it just didn't work that well. This one is a lot better. And there is a slight difference in the color of the back design as well, I believe. Looks pretty cool when you a little bit cool when you fan them out. There is I believe maybe a bit of a one way back. I could be wrong though. <laughs> and the faces definitely look pretty interesting when you fan them out. I definitely think they're interesting but I'm not a huge fan of this index with the suit and the number and then a prison symbol for it. I can understand it and the demand and the need for it but it does affect it a little bit in my opinion the usability of it but it's pretty interesting I like it I got no complaints no real complaints so that is that that's the prison empire royal edition if you didn't see the review for the previous one go check it out just search on my channel in the search bar for prison empire or go to the kickstarter playlist and you'll find it all right see ya